Hello. You're a star. Yeah. <laughs> well done, man. Great work. Keep it up. There's going to be three new chords I show you in okay. terms of fingering. The first is a C. There's the C you're playing. You want to play a C over G, which is meaty. Like that. So you're putting this finger that was there on the third fret of the E string. And then you're bringing your fourth finger in. So you're playing a G with your C. Okay? The good reason that you play that is because when you move to the G, you want to get in the habit of playing the G in that formation. So this finger is already on the G. And you want to be playing it like that. And the reason is you want to play the bass line like this. Practice that as much as you can. So Okay, last one is the D7. When you play the D7, bring this finger onto the second fret, onto the F sharp. Again. So you're not playing that E string at all. Okay? The only other thing I wanted to add, apart from when you practice, just practice playing with your thumb on the bass line, yeah. uh, is playing the G. Okay, now this chord is a C over G. Yeah. Mute that A string and just practice. Go in between the two. Mute the A string, right? Okay. Muting the A string so it sounds like this. There's your G. All the strings, C over G. Okay. Really good habit to get into. We're working out some mute strings from this. Yeah. Okay. Okay, wicked. Brilliant. Thank you very much.